my channel. I am Cute Little Voice. Today I'm coming in with another wig analysis on Keyshawn, ladies. I have been waiting for this unit. I have bought four, yes, not one, not two, not three, but four Keyshawn units to showcase to you guys um, today. Well, only I'll be sh only showing you three today, but I do have one on the way to show you. If you're new to my channel, what are you waiting for? Subscribe down below because what? This channel is popping, so let's get it popping. Okay, so yes, ladies, I do have a lookbook for you guys. If you want to speed through to the lookbook, I'll leave this time right here. Go to that time, and the look the lookbook will start for you guys. So here are the three that I have for you today. I have the color DRFF2 Cherry Red. I also have the DRST4 Ginger Spice, as well as the DRFF2 Blind Balage. So these are the three I'm going to um, review to you guys today. So um, let's talk a little bit about the unit before I show you the unit. Um, now it comes with two combs at the front, one in the back with the adjustable straps. Um, this is the Blind Balage color right here. As you can see, the texture is a, a medium yucky texture. I can run my hand straight through this one. I'm not getting a whole lot of shedding, although it is shedding a little bit, but nothing to be too concerned about. Um, you do get all of that parting space in there. So that's the parting space you do get. You got two cones on the side, one in the back with the elastic band, which is pretty tight. So. I don't know it may fit um it may fit you if you have a bigger head but if you want to um cut it out if it's too tight but if you have a smaller head you may want to just tie this one in the knots and kind of you know wear it like that so it can fit to your head but this one is pretty secure um now with the other units the caps were just medium size um well, on, only one of the units was medium size, but the other two came pretty spacious with the um, cap. So, and it does have that stretch, as you can see right here. So it will conform, conform to your head pretty well. I just love this texture. It is absolutely gorgeous. This color right here, when I put when I first put it on, I wasn't too sure about the color because I was like, hmm, I don't really know because I really did like the ginger spice color on me. And so this one, when I when I put it on and I wore it for a good 15 minutes before I did this review, um, I really liked it. And I really love this color. I feel like this color would look so pretty on any skin tone, in my opinion. So um, like I said, with all of the units, barely any shedding, barely any tangling. Well, no tangling at all as, as of right now. Um, like I said, the caps are pretty much big head friendly. Um, the luster is nice, no um, shiny look to it. Um, it has no smell, um, as well as you cannot see any tracks in the unit. It's a full density without being too like overly full. It's a nice natural density, as you can see, putting all the hair together. This is all the hair you're getting. So it's a pretty nice density, not too full and definitely not skimpy. So you don't have to worry about it being on the thinner side. But um, that's all mainly I can say, but let me tell you before I leave here that the parting space is pretty good. Um, and also the hairline is pre-plucked to perfection. Like the hairline, in my opinion, does not need to be plucked anymore. I think you would just over pluck if you did decide to pluck, but it came flawless. Mm, chef's kiss, just amazing. If you wanna know about this hair I have on, this is Harena from Bobby Boss. And I wore it today, my son has surgery. And so um, I wore this and I got, a total of four compliments told I was very pretty <laughs> and I mean everybody was like really loving this wig this is a 
beautiful fall wig to go to. Um, I think you can pick this one up on Elevate Styles right now. And so, yes, um, that's all I have for you guys. If you have any more questions, make sure you jot them down below. Let's start the lookbook. Bye. See you later. See you later. And oh, before we go, my favorite color is the uh, Balash Blonde and as well as the uh, ginger spice. The uh, cherry red was a little bit too toned down for me. It's like a, a muted red. So yeah, just for your information. But I'll see you soon. Bye bye.
What? 